Let's see if we can simplify 6 to the 1 half power times the fifth root of 6 and all of that to the third power. I encourage you to pause this video and try it on your own. So let me actually color code these exponents just so we can keep track of them a little better. So that's the 1 half power in blue. This is the fifth root here in magenta. And let's see, in green, let's think about this third power. So one way to think about this fifth root is that this is the exact same thing as raising this 6 to the 1 fifth power. So let's write it like that. So this part right over here we could rewrite as 6 to the 1 fifth power. 6 to the 1 fifth power. And then that whole thing gets raised to the third power. That whole thing gets raised to the third power. And of course, we have this 6 to the 1 half power out here. 6 to the 1 half power times all of all of this business right over here. Now what happens if we raise something to an exponent and then raise that whole thing to another exponent? Well, we've already seen in our exponent properties, that's the equivalent of raising this to the product of these two exponents. So this part right over here could be rewritten as, this part right over here could be rewritten as 6, 6 to the 3 times 1 fifth is 3 fifths. 6 to the 3 fifths power. 6 to the 3 fifths power. And of course, we're multiplying that times 6 to the 1 half power. 6 to the 1 half power times 6 to the 3 fifths power. And now if you're multiplying some base to, some, to this exponent, and then the same base again to another exponent, we know that this is going to be the same thing. And actually, we could put these equal signs the whole way, because these all equal each other. This is the same thing as 6 being raised to the 1 half plus 3 fifths power. 1 half plus 3 over 3 over 5. Now what's 1 half plus 3 over 5? Well, we could find a common denominator. It would be 10. So that's the same thing as, actually let me just write it this way. This is the same thing as 6 to the, instead of 1 half, we can write it as 5 over 10. Plus 3 fifths is the same thing as 6 over 10. To 6 over 10 power, which is the same thing, and we deserve a little bit of a drum roll here. This wasn't that, this wasn't that long of a problem. 6 to the 11 tenths power. 6 to the, I'll just write it all in, 11 over 10th power. And so well, that looks pretty simplified to me. I guess we're done.